so goddamn heated. Freaking this old lady, like I, she's super confusing on the phone, has been contacting me every week to come out and do a site meeting. It's two hours away. The party's like 30 people. Uh, I keep telling her like, no, I can't make it out. Can't make it out. I just don't know how to tell her that I don't care about her 30 person party two hours away. But the problem is there is an event planner who I work with all the time who keeps calling me too, seeing when I'm going to go up, when I'm going to go up. Well, it took two hours to get up here. Should take an hour and a half, but it's winter and I'm going down bum freaking roads. Uh, I get here. My truck can't get up the driveway. It's not plowed. So I'm not going to waste this trip out here. I'm going to go up. I thought, you know, I'll, I have this one here and I have another one on the way back home. So, uh, you know, me waiting and always putting her off, putting her off actually, I thought was going to work out because I had a second meeting out here. But now I'm just freaking pissed. And now I'm going to walk up this freaking driveway, look at the backyard and be like, oh, yep. 20 by 30 will fit here. <laughs> you gotta be effing kidding me. So I started walking up it and I was like, F this. Let me look at a satellite. Here's a satellite image. This is where I am. This is where the house is. And I was just like, I'm not doing this. I'm done. I, I'm i done. So the event planner who she's working with is in town, which at this point is 40 minutes away. So I'm on my way back through. I'm going to stop in and say, listen, if you guys want it measured, when it turns nice out, you measure it and tell me what size you tank you need because I'm not coming back up here to me to do this stupid thing. This is ridiculous. Uh, I know like, I'm going off on this. I I'm, go I'm definitely going off on this. I sound like an idiot, but sometimes these on-site meetings, you just want to rip your hair out. Did you know that's why I have no hair? Because there was an on-site meeting which was like this and it ripped my hair out. Not really. Uh, most of them are good and fine, but from the very first time this lady called, I just knew like, this one's gonna be annoying. This is going to be an annoying one. And I was right. I just spent two hours of my freaking day driving out here to look at nothing. Ugh. Okay, so this next meeting that I am showing went a lot better. Uh, I actually went whitewater rafting at this place before. It used to be the central hub for the whitewater rafting. You'd go there get all ready and then go wait for a rafting then come back and have hot hot dogs so i remember this place someone has since bought it and just turned it into their own private property but this meeting went well and i recorded the audio of that with a little bit of video and a picture that i talk about later in the video oh adam yep Gene. nice to meet you Gene. Gene too. hopefully this meeting goes better than my last one uh -oh. what happened? i drove all the way down south shore road to basically at uh, the end, you know, going 15, 15, 20 miles an hour because of the roads. Get there. The lady never had her plow, her driveway plowed. So I'm like, I'm not wasting this trip. So I start walking up her driveway and then I pull up satellite real quick. And I'm like, only a fraction of the way. And I'm like, I'm not doing this. Mm. I'm turning around. Oh, wow. Yeah, this, he keeps this plowed out. He's here, yeah, they're no. weekenders now. But, right. Um, they're going to move up here eventually. But we thought back in here. Okay. Pretty good sized tent. Um, just in case it rains. You never know. And then we thought maybe another tent. I'm not sure if he, probably not over there, but over in here. I'm not sure because the food's going to be in that building. So I don't know if there's really room to put a tent. With. Why aren't you going to do the food in this big building? Just two. That, that's a, that's got a full of stuff. Oh, it's yeah, not this is empty open now. anymore? What's that? We we came rafting here and it was oh. open. Oh, it's open, but it's full of his stuff. Is it? Okay. Yeah, so we can't really use it. So food's going to be here. So well, how many I, people have you got? Well, we don't know. I mean, we're estimating maybe 125. 125. Possibly more or less. I mean, we just don't know. Okay. Uh, we thought a food, uh, a big tent because we want it, we're going to have a DJ. Yeah. And we're going to have activities and everybody could fit under it if it rained. And then another tent, smaller tent for overflow or whatever. Okay. And what's the event again? It, uh, Okara Lakes is yeah, yeah. celebrating 100 years being around. Okay. So it's just seating. It's not like a dance floor. Well, and... we might dance, but okay. you know, if we did, we'd dance on the stones. Yeah. Well, I don't care if you rent a dance floor from me or not. I'm just trying to determine 
the, the space needed for it so I can determine yeah. the size of the okay. tent. It, we intend to, we are having a DJ, so there could okay. be dancing. Um, so leave a little room. Yeah. Okay, well. We've got this whole area uh, close over here. Yeah, so I'm thinking a uh, 30 by 60 frame tent. Okay. Right here. Uh, maybe a 20 by 30 that we can back up to the, the um, awning. Okay. And then you can use the awning. Yeah. Why don't you do your food there so people don't have to all walk over there? Well, we're going to, we got to decide about bears. That's our issue. Right. Uh, if he can, he'll make space in here, but yeah. I don't want to put the guy out. He's gracious enough to yeah. use it. Yeah. Well, you're going to have to clean up after yeah. if yeah. you do it there. The bears aren't going to come around when there's 125 no, people here. No, they won't. But they might overnight. So we may end up with the food over here. I don't know at this point. Okay. Um, so yeah, I'm thinking 30 by 60 uh -huh. here. With sides? Uh, yeah, we can do sides. Yeah. Um, and then a 20 by 30 there. That way the 30 by 60 will come out past the building a little bit and it won't feel like they're separated because okay. they'll be like near each other. Okay. All right. Um, do you have any idea what that? I'm going to build a quote. I do not have an okay. idea. I, I don't, I, it's way too hard to memorize That's all the okay. prices. Two things. We're a nonprofit. Okay. So I'm. Tax I'm, exempt. Yeah. Okay. And, um, we, if we could cut, cut a break on the price. Guess what? <laughs> I don't everybody care. Asks I don't. Yeah, everybody. <laughs> I, I get at least five phone calls a week yeah. of people, yeah. and uh, I can't do it. Okay. Well, whatever you can do. Let me uh, know. Right. Uh, yeah. Basically, every person who works for a nonprofit calls, and I understand their job, and I get it. But what they're doing is they're thinking about their job. They're not thinking that every single event starts with a party for a fundraiser, and that I get five phone calls a week from other people and i understand it because they're thinking about their thing but they're not thinking how many people have called this guy already this week yeah. so well whatever you could do yeah and, uh, it, but we are non -profit. okay so yeah um, i can do the tax off yeah but yeah and that'll that'll be good um i don't think we want to dance floor we have a meeting a week from friday okay um and i'm just getting information ahead of time so if i could get that quote before the 14th yep yeah. And, with, and just um, if you could put in there, if we had a dance floor, how much extra? It would be. Okay, I'm yeah. gonna say no. Every item will be. Uh, there's a line for each item, okay. and it'll have it in there. Okay. Um, but I don't think you need a dance floor either. This is hard ground. Yeah. I just wanted to account for it, so I knew Spacing. what space to yep. give you. Yeah. Gotcha. So, yeah. So we probably don't need it then, and just as long as we get the size of the tent. Okay. And it's it's up to the him, the homeowner, where he wants us to set up the food and stuff. We we'd love to use that, but he's got it full of his. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Stuff. Cool. Um, yeah. Sorry, I for some reason, you know, I was here when I was younger doing a white ra water rafting thing. I thought it was before Camp Nazareth and the Boy oh. Scout camp. Oh yeah, no, no. Um, no. I and I haven't paid attention to where it is since then because the sign's gone. Yeah. And yeah. Well, it could have been something down that way, but Whitewater Challengers is always here. No, this is where I have a picture of me and my friends yeah. right here. I'm actually going to take a picture of this. Okay. Because uh, I remember the door yep. and all that. I actually had to Photoshop the door because we had a girl. I had a girlfriend in the picture with me, and uh, we I took her out and I had to rebuild the door in Photoshop <laughs> uh, using that so I could take take her out of it. But. All right. Okay. Yeah. Uh, okay. We have my numbers. So yeah, I don't know if I'll get to to it today, but I'll get I'll have the oh. office guy do the quote tomorrow. Before next Friday. Okay. Yeah. Great. You text it to me or email it. Uh, yeah, yeah, we'll email. You don't it. Have my, do you have my yeah, email? yeah, you emailed okay. me the uh, address oh, and everything. That's right. Okay.